Hi, this is Steve from Deep Instinct. Thanks for spending a couple of minutes with me to learn a little bit about one of the newest variants of ransomware we're seeing out in the market today, Ransom EXX. So over the past few months, we've seen some pretty significant attacks with this variant of ransomware. This is a little bit different than others that you might see most today are distributed you know, through phishing attacks and things like that, but this is a manually operated ransomware. So essentially the attackers in some way penetrate an organization's environment, they get in there, they learn about it, and then they they manually deploy this ransomware. So it's a little bit different. There's some, as I mentioned, there's some pretty big attacks. So what I'm going to do is I want to talk to you about things that you can do to protect yourself and how our solution that we offer at Deep Instinct works to actually prevent this ransomware before it can execute. If you're not familiar with us, let me just give you a really quick high level overview of what we're about. So here at Deep Instinct, we do believe that great security starts with prevention. And that's what we are here to do to help organizations understand that we can help you prevent more attacks from uh, impacting your environment, which is going to help you decrease your costs and the time associated with keeping your, your organization secure. So we do start with prevention. We do have detection response capabilities as well. The whole idea here is there's plenty of expert tools on the market. Our tools and solutions are designed to be used by anyone. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at how Deep Instinct is going to handle this ransomware. So one thing I had to do, the way that our solution works, as I mentioned, we do a pre-execution file analysis of any files that are moved to the disk or downloaded. As that's occurring, that's when we're gonna do our analysis to identify if something's malicious or not. So it's even before uh, at execution, we call it pre-execution or at zero time. So in order for me to even download the file, I had to disable our prevention capabilities. So I've downloaded the file here. We can see it's, it's here right now. So what I'll have to do quickly is go into Deep Instinct and change the policy to re-enable prevention. So I'll go in here, it's very simple. I'm gonna turn on prevention. So this is the, uh, the, deep, the brain that's running on the endpoint. And what I'm also gonna do is I'm going to go down to the dbrain package. So this is actually, as I mentioned, it was we train a model that gets deployed to our end users. The model that I'm going to test today is our model 109. So this model was trained in November of 2018. Our latest model is 118, which was just released last month. But I'm, I'm and I'm sure we would be able to identify with that. But I want to see can we identify it with almost a two-year-old model? So I'm going to go ahead and select that, and I'm going to apply those changes. And then all I need to do now is go to my endpoint and check for these updates. You'll see that it was in detect only. So I'll have it check for updates. And then it, we should see that it flips over to detect and prevent immediately. So I don't really need to do much with this file. I just actually, if I just try to copy it to my desktop, I would expect at that point, as I expected, we identified it. So as the file was being attempted to move, be moved to the desktop, that Deep Instinct performed that deep file static analysis and was able to identify it as malicious right then and there. So right immediately, the threat of that file causing any trouble in my environment has been eliminated. To recap, what did we see? So this was the uh, variant of ransomware that we were looking at. So I was, as I mentioned, I was using a brain that was released and trained in November of 2018. So we know in this past year, there've been some three fairly high level breaches with this form of ransomware. So today we went through and I confirmed that we were able to prevent, to detect and prevent this ransomware from running in my on my test machine with a brain that was trained 22 months earlier. Right, so that is really just demonstrating the power of deep learning and how we've deployed it to deliver resilient prevention. So if you have any more questions or would like to learn more about our solutions, please do reach out to us and visit us at deepinstinct.com. Thanks.